The newly appointed High Commissioner to Sri Lanka, Santosh Jha, called on Prime Minister Dinesh Gunawardena at the Temple Trees yesterday. The Prime Minister's office reported that a detailed discussion was held on economic ties and cooperation between the two countries. The duo also examined ways and means of expediting the proposed joint projects. Discussions had further focused on the possibility of more Indian investments in the energy sector, including solar, wind power, joint projects on the Trincomalee oil storage tanks, ports, railways and other sectors. Prime Minister Dinesh Gunawardena thanked India for the assistance extended to Sri Lanka during its economic crisis, particularly through the provision of debt restructuring facilities and through the provision of relief material, food and medicine. The Sri Lankan Premier also thanked India for the support given to secure the IMF package to solve the country's liquidity issues. The new Indian High Commissioner, meanwhile, recalling his tenure in Sri Lanka from 2007 to 2010, said he considers it a great privilege to be in Colombo once again to work towards bolstering bilateral friendship and cooperation. He further stressed the need for early steps to implement the Indo-Sri Lanka Economic Partnership vision and the 14-point programme agreed to by the leaders of the two countries. High Commissioner Santosh went on to say that it is his mission to work with the people of Sri Lanka for the benefit of Sri Lanka under the guidance of Sri Lankan leadership. He also assured that Indian expertise will be extended to Sri Lanka for its plans for digital infrastructure development, including introducing digital IDs for every citizen and for the development of IT education.